Thank you, Zach. Today, Elmira College issued a vaccine mandate requiring all students to be vaccinated by October 8th. The college cited the rapid spread of the Delta variant and the recent rise in COVID cases for this to be a necessary measure. We want to get back to as normal a term as we possibly can for our students, and we believe that having the students be fully vaccinated will not only protect our campus community, but will also allow us to give the students the experience that they expect and that they deserve. Prior to arrival on campus for the fall semester, students are required to show proof of vaccination or a recent COVID test. We do expect to have some pushback from parents and students. A huge reason for this mandate is so the college can safely loosen their restrictions. Vaccinated right now, we don't have a masking requirement and we are completely back to in-person learning. The students can go in any of the residence halls, so that will open up, you know, a lot of socializing for them. Students who have a medical or religious reason for not getting vaccinated can submit a form requesting exemption, which will be reviewed for determination by health services. Say someone has an allergy uh, to the, the vaccination or a health condition that um, could get worse if they were vaccinated. Reasons such as political beliefs, concerns about unconfirmed side effects, and non-belief in vaccinations are considered an invalid excuse to the school. The college is following the recommendation from the CDC, American College Health Association, and local health departments. All of them are recommending that the best way for us to resume uh, the most normal experience for students for our campus community is by having people be vaccinated. The notice states that any eligible student who refuses to become fully vaccinated by that deadline will need to leave campus along with other consequences. Until then, those that are not vaccinated